So, you know, with, with that said, uh, have you seen any systems that you have more of an affinity to? Obviously, you coming from biblical research, but um, outside of that, have you seen any any one system where you've said, okay, this is this is how it should be done? You know what? I haven't. So, okay. <laughs> because mm -hmm. uh, you know, you mentioned earlier the uh, the colonization, the uh, colonialism that right. has uh, ravaged almost every part of the world, um, and that's from Anglo culture, the Spanish, the Portuguese, the Dutch. Uh, and uh, the Italians, uh, because they traveled um, through, um, through you know, with, uh, and this is, of course, several hundred years old, but uh, when they started out traveling the world uh, via their naval fleets and merchant ships, they were able to reach all parts of the globe. They would go into the interior of these lands and they would change their systems. Uh, mm -hmm. Like in the Caribbean, for instance, uh, the Caribbean vibe is very polygynous, but it's de facto. It's, it's right. a fact and instead of by law. But people still retain that uh, that biological drive to right. engage in polygyny. That's the men. And, that's the men and the women, uh, you know, attaching themselves to one man. Uh, mm -hmm. But not one system has everything at this point that I have seen, even in Islam. And I've heard a lot of. <laughs> I've gotten a lot of messages from people uh, online who are, who are trying to push that Islam has a complete system, but from what I've seen, even that's not a complete system. Okay. Okay. Only due to colonialism, now, though. 